Hello there and welcome to another episode of History Book Corner. I am your host, John Miller. I'm the Executive Director here at the Shippensburg History Center. And today's book is a book that was written by Robert Orson as well as Ranger Dan Welsh, uh, personal friends of mine. And it's a book called The Last Road North. It's part of the Emerging Civil War series that was published by Savas Beatty in 2016. So this book here, what stands out about this book, it's not your average everyday Gettysburg history book. This book here actually gets you out into the field to experience the sites as well as the historic places where certain events took place. So if you wanted to travel the entire Gettysburg or Pennsylvania campaign, this is a good companion for you to do so. Chapter one pretty much starts right out in Virginia following the Civil War trails as you go in for, uh, from Virginia into Maryland and eventually making your way into Pennsylvania. So if you wanted to follow, for an example, Brigadier General Albert Jenkins's Confederate Cavalry Brigade, you can do that by going through, looking at this book, and then you can hit the sites up like Greencastle, Chambersburg, Shippensburg, Carlisle, um, or if you want to follow in the footsteps of Jeb Stewart's Cavalry, you can also do that as well. There's a lot of information in this book here, and the way it's broken down, you can follow the entire Gettysburg or Pennsylvania campaign any way as you choose. Now, when Dan started writing this, he had to bring in uh, Rob Orson into the project, but then you also have Ranger Matt Atkinson who contributed to this project, as well as I did, and for an example, if you wanted to go ahead and follow the retreat from Gettysburg, you know, there's a wonderful section in here that I wrote about the retreat from Gettysburg, and this will help kind of guide you back into Virginia um, after the Battle of Gettysburg. So just a wonderful way to experience history and to be able to take in all of the sites and historic places that soldiers would have seen. Um, you know, if you wanted to follow the Army to the Potomac, for an example, there's areas in this book here that shows you where General George Meade was on the day that he re received his promotion to command the Army of the Potomac, for an example. So, all around, great book. You can buy these on Amazon, or you can buy these at the Visitor Center over at Gettysburg. I think the price on these was actually like 20 bucks, which is not much, but I'm telling you, if you're the type of person who loves to travel and see and experience different things and you want to take in some history, go ahead and grab this book. You'll, you won't be uh, disappointed, I promise you that. So until then guys, I hope you're enjoying this new series and we'll keep bringing them to you. So until then, take care.